Welcome to my video. The idea is to show you how I unboxed a couple of monitors from Dell and then how I connected them on a daisy chain mode with so both my laptop and desktop can work together. Stay tuned. So I've got two Dell Ultra Sharp 27 inches 4K USB C monitor by Dell. This is a present for my wife. Model is U. 2723QE so I will I will share with you how I install it and how to do it because um, I'm, I'm looking for a daisy chain so she can connect her laptop which is this um, HP uh, computer from work and my hub will no longer be needed so that will have to go because this this screen allows to having uh, that connection the unboxing of the the whole um, screen as you can see comes pretty well protected and should be relatively straightforward to mount it uh, i guess the challenge is ensuring that the cables go in the right place so this comes with a calibration report from factory, which is good. Really interesting. Wow, look at this. Very impressive. Mm, some instructions. Uh, very quick instructions. The number of cables we have. How to install it. Should, should be easy. And then... Uh, if you are doing a single screen or more than one screen, how to do it. So yeah, let's have a look. So we have the cables. This is a display port. This is a USB-C cable. This is a USB uh, to USB-C cable. And obviously the um, connection for the monitor, the power. Uh, recommending that you upgrade the LAN driver, which should be very straightforward. The Some stickers on the energy consumption, as you can see, this is F. So 26 kilowatt hours, not the most efficient. Uh, what is next? We have the warranty and service. Should be straightforward. So you put it there. Good. So after a successful unboxing, this is the scenario that I faced. I have both monitors with lots of ports and um, Ethernet connections and power connections. And I, as I said at the beginning, I have my desktop and laptop to make the connections. The Both the camera and the speaker, who I use a lot for Teams meetings, and the keyboard and mouse, those three resources are to be shared between both computers. So you will see in a minute all the connections that I have done to make this um, work properly. So uh, continue watching. Thank you. Okay. So I managed to make this work, but I have to say it was a little bit of trial and error and also by rereading many times the manuals to understand how to do this. I was a little bit uncertain what does upstream and downstream ports mean but i now crack it and i will talk you through my setup so my objective is to have two different laptops this one and this is my wife this is my laptop and our home desktop connected to both screens on on simultaneously because these screens allow you to do that and sharing the same network the same mouse mouse the same keyboard 
and speakers and you name it. So this is how I did it. But let me just talk you through. This is my um, Ethernet that goes into my router or router as some people call them. This is obviously my mouse and keyboard. This is my camera. Nowadays, you know, working remotely, you need camera strongly. This is my speaker, which I have for, which we use for uh, Teams. This is, and this is where things are getting interesting. This cable goes to my desktop. And this is the link to enable all the device devices to connect to the desktop. And it's just a USB-C to a normal USB, A or B, into the desktop. This one, that is the port with this sign, is the daisy chain display port that goes here. This cable, which is a USB-C with charging capabilities, is the cable that fits the USBs on the laptops. As simple as that. So I hope um, this will help some of you how to do your connections. Just, just, just be aware that this, this has to be some logic uh, behind what you're doing. I decided to insert also this diagram to give you kind of a different perspective to what I showed you in the video before. Maybe to hopefully you can understand a little bit better where each of the cables go. If you need to pause this video, please do to help you understand how each connect the connections have to do or where have to go uh, to make this work. Firing up my desktop now to see if the connections that I have just double check are still okay because you know I rewire things to make them look tidy because I like I like how things look tidy look at this my my router always has to be super tidy same colors so I like to keep things very tidy well to a certain degree as you can tell it's impossible to make it perfect but yeah to the best of my ability so let, let's let's see if things fire up because he's looking for is it was looking for the, the the laptop and as you can see it's perfect it's, it's the desktop the desktop um so all is good okay so everything looks okay now i don't know what is this so yeah all good guys as you can see beautiful screens everything's working fine now Perfect, thank you.